morning, good evening, and good afternoon. Oh, I'm missing some dye. Uh, yeah, let's let's take uh, just chunk of bone meal. Uh, I want to get into Botania today, and I'll tell you why. Because I think it'll be fun. There, enough said. So let's get ourselves a decent amount of floral fertilizer. Uh, clear out a little bit of a grassy spot. And then hope we get some flowers. So we need 16 colors of flowers to, uh, to be good. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. All right, we're most of the way there, and most importantly, we got ourselves. You know, let's just do the, the remainder. We got ourselves the white flowers, because that's how you get started in Botania, Botania, Botanolandia. Uh, you can dupe the flowers by just planting them with bone meal, the, the petals you get with bone meal, and then and, uh, and growing them and then cutting them down with shears. Let's get some shears just in case. Now we want, oh, we got plenty. Now we're also going to want a petal apothecary, forgot to add that to the list. And just get some cobblestone slabs. Boom! We got the beet. We got the seeds. Uh, gosh darn it. So, floor fertilizer, done. Uh, and what I want to do is I want to just get started in Batania. Enough to get the mana, enough to get the mana going, um, so that way it'll be there when, when I need it. But yeah, yeah I mean that's that's just basically my goal: get Batania started enough so I've got the the mana when I need it, and move on to the next project. Uh, I will be delving deeper into Batania, of course, but. Just for now, I just want to get basic start. So let's grab a stack of stone, eight wood. Yeah, I'm gonna want more wood than that. You can, you can pure daisy, right? Yeah, you can pure daisy. Let's get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, because I goofed. And that's okay. While I'm waiting on that, let's work on the endo flame, which is just gray, brown, and red. I'm gonna want eight of these. So it is two brown, so I need so at Botania. I need a lot more. Oh, that's that's the mushroom. So we're gonna need a lot more brown. Uh, we've got. We're gonna need a little more red and light gray. We got. So all you do is doop 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 doop. Make sure you shear those big boy flowers, because uh, otherwise uh, you won't get the flowers, which is bad. You want the flowers. You want the flower power. Yes, give me all the living wood. I don't know exactly how much I need to get, but nope, that's not what I wanted to do. I'll just get a decent amount. It won't hurt to have some extra. And, I mean, eventually we'll automate it, but... Alright, and then white, let's just do... And then... The gray... The bone meal... So, you guys and you guys. So, we need eight of these, which is one, two.
to one one seeds. So let's put the seeds here and the bucket here and then the empty hand there. Just enough to make a mana pool. Ain't that handy and dandy and totally a coincidence. Like, I'm, I'm not even joking, guys. That is actually a coincidence. I did not intend to get exactly enough for a mana pool, but it worked out that way. Alright, let's head back. So what we're going to want is a mana pool. Going to want to get to a mana splitter and a couple extra pools eventually, but... For now, this will do a mana spreader. One, two, three of you. Uh, we'll just make a we'll just make a red one. Sounds fine to me. Uh, we'll we'll just set it up outside, right about. So that is bound to that. So now we put the endo flames. If we look, yep, they're all bound. That's good. That is exactly what we're looking for. Oh, whoops. some furnace fuel. So, hmm. We're going to need a wooden pressure plate and some redstone. What we want to do is we want to set it up so it feeds... Yeah, we'll do wiggle wood. Mm, delicious wiggle wood. We need you. We need some redstone. And a hopper. What the open crate does is it just drops item right there on the ground. So if we turn off our magnet first, they should eat them soon. Yeah, and we're now making mana. Yes. But what I, I don't want it to run all the time. So what I'm going to do is do some redstone chicanery. So give me that redstone. Oh, no. And maybe... Now 
what we want to do is I'm going to put a whole stack of dirt in there. Perfect. And it drops more dirt. Exactly what I'm looking for. Do you mind? I am doing stuff. Oh yeah, I upgraded the rest of my armor. Uh, nothing too fancy. But enough to help a little bit. A little bit of mana boost, a little bit of mana regen. I mean, I'll take your membranes, but... Rude. actually know how much mana that's going to make, so I'm just going to let that run for a while, actually, and see what happens. Um, but we can make the mana splitter with just a little bit of mana steel. And what that does is that just splits mana that's pushed into it to um, adjacent pools. So what we want is one, two, three mana pools. Iron times two. And let's see if we got enough mana to mana pool it up. Or to mana spread it. We do. We do. So we just want one more spreader. All right. So the mana splitter goes here. Mana pools go here, here, and here. And we will have four mana pools eventually. It'll be a while. But that's why I'm setting this up now. You know, just so that way we got plenty of mana for when the time comes for it. Let's just grab a little more blaze, because I got plenty of blaze. There we go. So however many I can get, 16, yeah, it'll be fine. perfectly renewable resource, so I'm okay with doing this. Are you full, my friend? No, I put an emerald upgrade in you. You aren't full. Alright, the other thing I wanted to work on was the player transmitter. Okay, so we have none of what we need. Alright, so we want one of you. Just keep some redstone blocks on hand to have them available. All right, so we just need two basic pastors, tiny, and then a player aerial pearl. Use an aerial pearl on a zombie or a husk, so aerial pearl. find a zombie or a kusk. I know you're out there. Oh, and uh, you get turned back on. And you go back today. Come on. Where's my zambo? I did pick up a zombie spawner, so I could just use that, but I'll go hunting. I wonder if it eats the zombie. Or if it just, uh, if it just activates the pearl. Nope. Okay, 
the phantoms are nice and all, I can use their membranes. But what I really want is a zombie. spellbook is that is fortune or well luck did it run away I think it ran away guys I don't think it's after me anymore god I think I would have gotten if I had enough mana Seriously, I need a zombie. I need a zombie quick. It's almost daytime. Zombies. Wherefore art thou? <laughs> it just eats them. Okay, that's fun. That's good to know. So, a player transmitter. Boom! And then we just need a binding card created to a player binding card and then what we want to do is we want to find mm, it's going to be daytime if we find an enderman we can make this uh, multi-dimensional but I'll work on that in a later Let's get a couple of those and upgrade to a basic. Hardened requires two of you, which is gold times two, iron times two. And we're going to want to not do that. We're going to want to boot that off. We're also going to want some more blaze rods, because we're going to have to upgrade our things. I okay, don't know if that despawned or if that, uh, if that did the right thing. You from here? Yeah, I can. Ha ha. Eat it, world. Okay, so I need. I'm just gonna save you. I think I need two of you. And then one more tear up the blazing. This does 8,000 forge energy a tick. And then player train runner. So if I am correct, if I put you there, give you the binding card. All right, let's test this bad boy out. Because if I am correct, what this should do is just power my stuff wherever the Hague in the world I am. Ooh, lots of phantom membrane. So let's head back to my mining area, still at the old base. Right, my flux capacitor is currently full, so I think that shows it's working. But we'll test it even harder. 
after we turn our magnet on. I also wasted some experience just uh, upgrading my gear. I had like I had 42 levels and I didn't bother storing them because I had 42 levels just for mining for a little bit. It's still full, guys. Player transmitter is working. What's this little area? It's a nice little cavey boy. Eh, whatever. Back home. Okay. So, the only thing I need to do now is power it interdimensionally. Which I can do as soon as I get an Enderman. Let me just uh, check you. Yeah, you're doing pretty good. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to make another one of those cards just so I can zap an Enderman if I happen to see it at all. Oh, and I also want, because I got an extra spawner, I want to make either a... An Enderman spawner or a Wither Skeleton spawner. So why don't I go to the Nether to work on both of those? Uh, maybe a little more Batania work, or maybe I'll let the Batania chill for a little bit. Yeah, they're definitely eating it. I'll let the Batania chill for a little bit, and I shall return. Once I am ready to do more work. Alright. I know what I'm going to do. Give me a whole stack. Let's take a trip, everybody. Get up on the roof. Oh, by the way, I got a dimensional binding card. I just right clicked on that man. We're going north, everybody. We're going north. So, I don't think I've ever legitimately taken on the Ender Dragon. Like, I've, I've never gone to the end without cheating my way there. Um, I mean, I mean, obviously, I'm you know this is modded up the butt, but I I'm hoping it'll be fun. Ooh, another end demand. Just a little more mana. No ender pearl. Oh, that was max. It's not quite max fortune or looting, but. Oop, wrong button. Whatever, I got a got an ender pouch. I can take it all home when I need to. Probably shouldn't be murdering all these creatures of nature, but that's okay. Is that a dolphin? I love how a fish can drop multiple fish. What kind of fish was that anyway? Tropical! Ooh, fancy. Oh, yeah, I ran out of torches. That's okay, I got a light spell. Nah, I'm not gonna bother grabbing kelp. I got that automated. Let's just check. Yep, yeah, still going straight north.
Pew. I'll grab some coal while I'm here. Occurred to me I probably should have brought a waystone. But then again, I might not have the materials to make a waystone. Because I did use up all my ender pearls making eyes of ender. Alright, so there's going to be a lot of traveling. So I will just catch you when I'm back nearer to the end fortress. Guys, it went back. Just after I crafted that boat. some cardboard boxes to grab spawners. Right? Yeah, right. Can I do anything with iron doors? Not really. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, I'm just going to stab you. Skeletons do not interest me in terms of loot. Gateway to Doom. Ow. I went into the Doom. second book like just for the light spell or maybe a wand I think this has wands Is that a chest ooh mana steel and a nebulous heart that's the much better find the nebulous heart let me tell you because I might need more ender pearls. I do not know how many uh, how many portal things this thing is gonna need filled in with the thing in the thing. Ignore that. That's just the house water. All right, but I gotta find the portal itself. Here's unexplored territory. Die, 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 die. Another chest. Ooh. You are facing the wrong way, good sir. Maybe I should have kept that bow. Eh. Not a big deal. Perish, perish, perish. Ooh! I can use books. That's 
a gateway to do. This would be a great time to have a flux saw. Man, this would have been helpful when I was doing my initial bout of enchanting. on the floor, that's me. Oh, that's a creeper. By the way, those catalyzing glands can be turned into uh, gas tears. So, you know, pretty handy. Okay, time to put more junk away. Yeah, I saw that spider. I don't care. Eh, it's a glowing bat. Did I put the nebulous heart? I did not. Alright, it's going that way. Black lotuses. Could have used those for a little oomph of mana. Okay. Well, I'll I'll check up there before I use another ender.
I'll be back when I find the board. I found it. I found it, guys. Oh, 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 oh crap. Well, ain't that a humdinger of a pickle, Manny? Oh, what does it take to make a waystone? Just one warp core, which is four ender pearls. Gosh, dingus, my dangus. I have home and I have back. So I'm going to use, oh god, I didn't wait, but I did. Okay, so let's, let's go back. Let's waypoint this. Just in case, let's go back home. Let's get ourselves two stacks of blaze rods. <gasps> Wait a minute. I got a waystone. Ha ha! What a little blaze mesh. It's a blaze mesh. Okay, let's keep the mana flowing. I put some uh, dried kelp in there at one point, just for fun. All right, we have our way to the end. which I actually could make, but it requires gas tears, which I, I, I guess I can get, but how many catalyzing glands do I have? I only have five, so no, not worth it. What? Did I, did I forget to, uh, I must have forgotten to activate it. White shimmering mushroom, just a white shimmering mushroom. Is that nickel? I'll take nickel. I don't really care about lava. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We need eight more. I guess we'll be back after a few more nights have passed. Seven eyes of ender. Eight eyes of ender. Three by three. Let's 
go. Yep, no surprise. There. Waiting for something. Should have done. I sh I should have brought uh, glass bottles. But that's okay. I'll live. This feels dangerous. Wandering around inside an obsidian pillar while there's a dragon outside. dangerous being this high. Oh. Ow. I might die. I do not want to touch this thing. Look at that end crystal freak out in the um one world I think. No, no, no. Oh, I didn't die. God, how am I gonna handle this? Okay. You're easy. You may not be as easy as you Oh, do I need? Yeah, I, I absolutely need a bow for this fight. Just make a new one. And we'll enchant it. Um, and then what does it take to make a jetpack? You know, that's more investment than I really want to do right now, so. Punch two, power four, and depending on how many arrows I have, I might be good with that. Yeah, I got a stack and a half. That's okay with me. I did not realize I was such a good shot with the dang bow. Feels very dangerous. I should eat some cheese. A little bit more hope. Nope, not who I wanted to hit. Running to the ground. Okay. I got 
to do is take out the crystals. Because we are the crystal gems. Come on. A little higher. Nice and slow. It's probably well past that level, but I'm gonna take out this dang Ender Dragon. You're floating in the middle, aren't you? That's okay, that's okay. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about a thing. Because the big thing is, if I get to an end city, that'll get me, or potentially get me an elytra, which kind of keeps making an angel ring, which I can use to get flight. It makes sense that they gate flight behind this fight, but it's still kind of frustrating to beat him without flying. vulnerable. sure the spells are doing anything. Thank you. 
losing. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Let's take it easy for a little bit. No, 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 no. Let's take it easy. We're all chill. We're all friends. You know what? End city next episode. For now, though, I'm going to wrap up the episode. Hope you... Oh, burpee. Hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time.